Hello everyone and welcome to this video. Today I will show you how you can sell an NFT on rarible.com. So quick thing before we get started, what is an NFT? An NFT stands for non-fungible token, which is basically a piece of digital art that is put onto a blockchain and then sold as digital art on a marketplace like rarible.com. Now there are different marketplaces for selling NFTs. Rarible is possibly the most like popular one, but there are cheaper alternatives like OpenSea, where you basically pay a one-time account fee to open your account, and then you can upload as many NFTs as you like. So this is a positive thing about OpenSea, but of course you'll also get less exposure there as compared to Rarible, simply because more people have heard of Rarible. You can think of Rarible as like the Amazon of NFTs, whereas OpenSea would be more like, I don't know, maybe Etsy or eBay. So it's certainly more popular on Amazon, but if you do want to sell on Amazon, it's obviously gonna be a bit more expensive. The first thing that you need to sell an NFT is of course some sort of piece of art. Art. And the good thing about this is you can upload anything. You can upload pictures, you can upload videos, anything in between. You can upload literally anything. First of all, you will have to create an Ethereum wallet. You can use any wallet really. I normally use the Rainbow wallet. The web address is rainbow.me and then you can just download it from the App Store or from the Play Store or whatever. Um, it's gonna look something like this. Obviously it will be on your phone and what we need is we need Ethereum Which is a very popular cryptocurrency the second most popular in the world So Ethereum is going to be the cryptocurrency that we use to pay for the gas fees for uploading an NFT And as well, it's going to be the currency that we will be paid in So keep this in mind all NFT transactions because they are a blockchain technology in the end They all go through cryptocurrency I have made videos on how to buy Ethereum as well on my channel. Of course, the links are in the description as well. Now it is important that you connect your Ethereum wallet to your Rarible account. And because this is not as straightforward as it may sound, it is quite simple, but a lot of people get confused with this. So I made a whole separate video about this. So you should open this in a new tab right now. This is really not because I want to make as many videos as possible. This is really because it's a different subject and a lot of people have trouble with this so I thought I might dedicate an entire video to this of course I put the link into the description so if you are experiencing trouble with connecting your wallet to your rareable account just quickly watch this video and then come back here so now we have connected our ethereum wallet to our rareable account and now we are ready to sell artwork now that we are here on rarible you will have to hit create and here you need to choose do you want to upload a single piece of art or multiple as in a collectible for now i'm just going to use single here you literally just drag and drop the file that you want to sell as an nft i have prepared a little earth here an earth.png so i'm just going to drag it there or oh, this doesn't work maybe i actually need to select it um, from my desktop so I'm just gonna select earth.png right here and then it's gonna be uploaded um, and then you set the price let's say you want to sell it for 10 ethereum maybe you're really optimistic this is like um, yeah thirty thousand um, dollars rarible.com takes a service fee of 2.5 percent um, guys, I'm actually gonna put this for sale and if any one of you buys it, I will use this money towards the circus project that I have in Kabul, Afghanistan to yeah, build a better future for the children there, for the local children in Afghanistan. This is not a joke, I actually have been to Kabul and I will go again in some months and I actually have this circus project there. So um, if you want to do something good, keep this in mind. I'll put the link into the description for you to buy Earth, of course. So let's just call it Earth, um, the title. I do, by the way, have the rights to use this. You shouldn't upload like weird copyrighted material. This might get you in trouble. I don't know exactly how it is, um, but only upload the stuff that you either create or that you are allowed to sell. And then you're gonna put in a description, whatever your description will be. And then the concept of royalties is quite interesting because this is where an NFT marketplace really differs from selling on eBay or Amazon, for example. Royalties basically means if I sell this earth to someone, let's say I sell it to you, 
and then I have set my royalties to 5% and then you sell it again to a third person, then out of this purchasing price that the third person gives you, I get 5% royalties simply because I have created it. Yeah. So this is quite an interesting concept. I'm just yeah, going to set it to, to 5%. Okay, and now I can hit create item and now it will send a notification to my rainbow wallet basically. It's going to connect with my rainbow wallet and it will say approve. Okay, it's connected now. So here I have to hit start. What is minting? Minting is basically just putting your NFT onto the blockchain. So right now I have um, received the notification here on my rainbow wallet um, and it says $52.41 is the network fee. And then I would have to pay this network fee, but luckily I have uploaded this earth already for $44 back then. So um, I'm just here to show you right now, guys, how you can actually sell your NFT. So now I would have to pay a network fee of $52. And then you want to hit confirm in your rainbow wallet and then you can set the fixed price and put it for sale. And then once you're done, you can literally just go to my items on Rarible. You can even upload a banner, a profile picture, your name. It's almost like your sales channel on eBay or on Amazon and you'll find your list here as I said I put it up for 10 ethereum some days ago and if you do buy it I will support the circus project that I have in Afghanistan with the money um, so do consider this if you do have a lot of money um, it would really like make so many children happy in Afghanistan um, anyway I hope this answers your question how to sell an NFT so let's go through this again very quickly you first of all need to create an ethereum wallet you need to buy ethereum for this in order to pay for the fee for the service fee um, there are different marketplaces to sell your NFT on Rarible is the most popular one but then there's also OpenSea OpenSea has the advantage that you pay a one-time fee for opening your account but then you no longer have to pay well the $44 that I just showed you yeah so on OpenSea you will pay like $200 or $190 by the time I create this video maybe it's going to be more in the future if Ethereum for example goes up it's going to be more expensive of course so jump in early if you're serious about NFTs um, if you do want to get max exposure though then use Rarible because obviously more people use it and then what you need to do is you need to hit create drag your file there put in the description put in the price you can have an auction you can have a timed auction or just a fixed price and then you basically need to mint it which will cost money um, and it will actually cost quite a bit of money like $44 for me it was to list this earth right now when I tried it if I would have minted it again right now it would have been $52 so keep this in mind the price there really fluctuates and it's also really dependent on the current ethereum price what ethereum itself trades for so keep this in mind when creating your nft artwork and then yeah you can just put it for sale and then share the link everywhere and then once you have successfully minted your nft you have your little shop page here where you can change the banner or they call it cover then you can edit your name your your profile picture and so on and it's almost like a little ebay or amazon shop that you have then and then yeah you can just share the link to anywhere and hope that your nfts will sell that's it for today's video i really hope you learned something today if you did smash the like button and leave a subscription i post daily videos mainly about crypto sometimes about traveling and about other projects that i run as i said if somebody actually buys some of my NFTs, the link is in the description, then with this money, I will support the circus school project that I have in Kabul, Afghanistan. I'll actually go there myself anyway this year again. And if I have some extra money to build up some infrastructure there, that would be really amazing. So yeah, thank you so much for watching. My name is Luca, I'm the German travel guy, and I really hope you enjoyed today's video. Bye bye.